The angelic world has been created from light. The jinns have been created from fire. And again, there are several ayats in the Quran to talk about the fact that they've been created from fire. Our essence comes from clay, from water, and from other elements. We've got a heavy material side to us. They've got a very light side to them. The essence is that they are, since they are of fire, you know, fire rises. Okay, fire ri or heat rises. So jinns and them being sort of non-tangible, they're able to fly, they're able to move around much more easily than ourselves. Now one particular incident is in Surah uh, uh, where, where Suleiman alayhi salam, he asks, he asks who is going to bring the um, arsh or the throne of Bilqis. So the interesting part there because there's, there's two different uh, beings that stand up. One is the actual jinn and one is the one who's been given the knowledge. And they say, according to Tafasir, they say that the one who's been given knowledge, some have said that is Jibreel, but others have said that it's actually another jinn that is stronger than this one. So if you look in Surah number 27, verse number 39, and, third, uh, and 40 you will find قَالَ عِفْرِيتٌ مِّنَ الْجِنِّ And Ifrit, Allah has given that name from the jinns said, I will bring it to you, I will bring Bilqis. Now Bilqis again is controlling a whole world of jinns and she's a jinn herself. And he says, I will bring you her throne to you قَبْلَ أَن تَقُومَ مِنْ مَقَامِكَ Before you can even stand up in your place. وَإِنِّي عَلَيْهِ لَقَوِيٌّ I mean, I'm strong and I'm also you know, I've got trust. And then the one who had the knowledge of the book said, he stood up and said, I can bring it to you before you, you can blink your next eye. And before he blinked, he saw the, the throne of Bilqis in front of him. And that was the power. Now, they can move some of them. Now again, it's to do with the power that Allah has given because some of them are weaker than others. Some of them are weaker than others. So some of them... Uh, can't move so fast but some of them uh, but others can actually move move fast some of them are more powerful than others and very clear from this part of the tafsir of the Quran that there's a strength amongst them that whether you know some of them have more power than, than, than others now interestingly Suleiman alayhi salam he was given you know the power over jinns he was the only human being that had the authority given by Allah to control jinns and Allah has given reference in the Holy Quran about that in Surah uh, Naml again, where um, Allah says, وَحُشِرَ لِسُلَيْمَانَ جُنُودُهُ مِنَ الْجِنِّ وَالْإِنْسِرْ وَالطَّيْرِ فَهُمْ يُزَعُونَ Surah Naml verse number, verse number 17 of Surah 27. That for, for Sulaiman, the jinns were gathered, the men were gathered, and the birds were also gathered. 